Hey guys, what's up and welcome to a brand new series called Skyrim Mod Spotlight. So in this series, we're going to talk about mods. I'm just going to give like a brief overview of them. Uh, this is usually more for mods that are smaller and add just a few uh, specific things. Um, this is going to differ from my Oblivion Mod Adventure series, in which I played more like a let's play of the mod. Um, but like I said, this is going to be for smaller mods. So for our first mod, we have um, an interface mod. Um, I really wanted to do something simple to sort of introduce this series, but uh, I really like this mod because it brings back the whole Oblivion look with like the, you know, charts. Because that really worked much better than the, the, the system that we have now where it's very, you have to scroll through everything. Now you can just, oh, that's what I want, click on it, oh, that's what I want, click on it. Um, and it categorizes them in a much better way. What I really like that you couldn't do in Skyrim for some reason is you can uh, order them specifically. Uh, like damage if I want my best weapons right at the top these are the ones that I want to use or if I'm looking to sell stuff I get rid of my crappy stuff well those are uh, stabs so they don't count but like if I wanted to get rid of my worst arrows that's what I could do I could just you know sell them or drop them or if I want to look for you know I want to I'm over encumbered and I want to get rid of some stuff I can just click on wait just be like yeah I'll get rid of this but obviously I don't want to do that it's an awesome bow and when you're selling stuff you can look for the highest value of item now, of course, you can always just look at all of this stuff, um, but the categories are weapons, apparel, potions, just like, you know, regularly, scrolls, food, ingredients, books, keys, and miscellaneous. Um, there are little items or icons here to help uh, separate, you know, the different things, um, but that only is really useful when you're looking at everything. And then, of course, there's this favorites menu right here. Um, filter huh now I haven't I haven't really looked into everything on this uh, mod uh, so uh, but I do know that you can change these icons up here and the text I'm pretty sure the text is uh, you know it changes all the text in the game not just for the interface you know at the items uh, menu and stuff let's take a look at this stuff this stuff is still all the same this isn't any different possibly one day they'll change that this is all the same and this is basically the same as far as i know i haven't really read into the mod all i know is when i saw this menu i was like i must have this so um for all future uh videos on my let's play uh it'll probably have that interface so technically it is a mod adventure any new let's plays that i put out um i still have to upload a lot uh, of recording still and I'll try to upload more often guys but I just wanted to start this series see if you guys like it and uh, of course like the video if you like it comment if you have anything to say and subscribe if you want these videos uh, well if you want more of these videos because when I see subscribers I know that I'm doing something right um, and of course guys also subscribe to my second channel it's a backup channel in the event that I get a third copyright strike which I got two because well, the first one was because I talked about unreleased content, um, and the second one was because I had music in my video. So, I'm going to be really careful, but, you know, that third copyright strike could happen any day. Um, and I may have to remove some videos with music in them, so um, don't be su surprised if some series uh, are removed from my channel. But, anyways, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.